Hey everyone, it's really nice to see you on our channel. First of all, please subscribe and thumbs up. In this video, I'm going to tell you how to add a voice messages to Slack uh, just using certain apps. We are going to take a look at three apps which are pretty easy to use and I think voice messages function is going to be very easy for you. And why would you need voice messages in Slack? Because sometimes it is not comfortable to type, you may not have access to certain emojis and people may think that you are rude or mean and you don't want that. Uh, therefore, for people to better understand your intonation or when you are in a rush, voice messages are a must-have and lifesavers. So let's not waste any of our time and let's just start this video. So I suggest that we take a look at the first method and with the first method we need to use an app called Standup LY. It is an app that you can add to your Slack and apart from voice messages you can also send video recordings and normal text. So adding a voice message to Slack using Standup LY is very easy and all you need to do is install Standup LY to your Slack workspace. By the way, the link I will leave down below in the description. Uh, go to the Slack channel and uh, click on private chat where you want to drop a voice message type uh, slash voice in the writing box and the platform will offer you to record a voice message after recording the voice message will be sent automatically so yeah as you can see there is nothing hard and just do it Another app and another method you might want to use to send a voice messages is Loom, which is available in Slack's app directory, which is pretty cool because you can download it pretty easy and I'll also leave the link down below. So Loom is another platform that you might use. It is an app that you install into your Slack and it allows you to send voice messages or video recordings. To send those, you just have to type slash Loom in your text box. and here is the instruction how to do that. So first of all, go to Slack app directory to download Loom, then install Loom and connect it to your Slack account. Add extensions to your Chrome or directly download the app for your desktop. You can type Loom or slash record to start recording your voice message. After you are fine, click on open and Slack comments. Uh, preview your voice message and click send. So uh, what is the difference? This one offers you a preview option and it is also pretty great, just go with the one that you might find yourself more comfortable using with. And the last method in our video, which we are going to take a look at, is called Voice Message App. So, uh, Voice Message App is an app for sending voice messages directly from Slack. Most of its functionality is provided for free, but there is a paid version uh, within extended possibilities. You can easily install it on Windows, Mac, iOS or Android, and to use it within Slack, you just have to type slash VM or slash voice message. So, as you can see, it is also very easy, nothing to worry about, nothing to think about. Yeah, that's basically it. So basically that was all I wanted to tell you guys. And if you like this video, don't forget to thumbs up and share it with your friends. Also check out the description down below where you can find the link to our article of how to add voice messages and Slack in case if something in the video was not clear. And in the article you can find two bonus methods on how to do that. And they are also pretty easy, so just to choose the method you like the most. Also check out our VP Globe, because there you can find many interesting articles about WordPress, SEO, uh, web development, etc. It was really nice to see you on our channel. See you in the next video, I guess. Bye!